All right, I got you guys set up here. I'm not sure that you can see all these little holes, but I took the blowgun to it with safety glasses. Um, I'm going to take a little pick in there, make sure there's not a bunch of crack in there, and grab the grease gun. saying well there's no zerk fittings on there well you're right there's not that's why you have to use a grease needle to do this I actually drilled a couple of them bigger which could possibly have been a mistake but it seemed like a good idea at the, at the time that I did it Some of these are a real bitch to get to up here with the snow deflector, but uh, as long as you keep fresh grease in it frequently, they usually take it. I'll probably eat my words here, but here's the apparatus you use. Stand back here, I guess. This is a grease needle, and inside here it's got a zerk fitting, and you just plug your grease gun into this end of it right here. And uh, the other end goes into the area like that. Now the key to making this work is to hold it tight against the uh, end of the grease gun because it will actually push itself off of the grease gun. what's happened. If it's taking grease or not, let's try another one. There it comes. There it comes. pressure it'll push itself off of the nipple and the grease gun and it's just an all-around pain in the ass seems okay also makes it easier to hold on to when it's starting to get greasy and nasty some grease in it today and I'll run it tonight or tomorrow and when it gets a little warmer I'll try it again. The grease that's in there is pretty thick. It's not pushing it out. Each one of these has a grease hole. Is try and straighten the plow out a little bit. This seems to really start to fight me. Different areas will want to take grease different ways, so try that. So you get the gist of that. That's uh, that's the maintenance and the replacement of that cutting edge and the rubber ones for the wings. So. Uh, there you go guys, 
watch the videos and uh, hope you pick something up. But there you go, the grease was put in through that hole and it's coming out in between them. I gotta work on these a little more to get more out of it, but that's the plain and simple way to do it. So, hope you enjoyed. We'll see you on the next one. Bye.